What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Josh back with another video. And if you guys are new to my channel and you're not subscribed, I appreciate it if you guys go down and smash that subscribe button and make sure you guys turn that notification bell on too so you can be one of the first to know when I drop a new video. And if you guys haven't checked out any of my older content, I really recommend you doing that. It's some dope content and I got a lot more coming for you guys. But anyways, today in this video, we're gonna be doing a review and an unboxing of one of Babish's new influencer collection trimmers. This is the Patty Cuts Edition. They have two other ones, but I'll tell you guys why I chose this one later in the video. Now let's get right to it. So like I said, this is one of the three new trimmers that Babyliss has for their new influencer collection. They have this green and black, they have a, a purple and black one, and they have a red and black one too. I'm going to post a picture on the screen so you guys can see all three of them. So you guys can see which one you like and which one you probably want to cop if you don't already have them. So like I said, this one in particular is the Patty Cuts Edition one. And the reason why I chose Patty is because I know him and I wanted to support my guy. And he's one of my top favorite barbers like in the whole industry i like his whole aesthetic if you guys want to follow him on instagram go follow him at patty underscore cuts with a s you guys will not regret it i mean just some dope work man so getting right into the design of the box you can tell that babbage let their influencers put their own touch to it and as you guys can see he has like a saint patrick's day theme if you guys don't know his name is patty short for Patty. so i guess that's how he came up with the whole saint patrick's theme so he has like the three leaf clovers and obviously with the green you know that's the St. Patrick's color, you know what I mean? So the box is all green with the four leaf clovers. It has a picture of him on the front. On the side right here, it has his story with a picture of him cutting Travis Kelsey, the guy that plays for the Chiefs. His Instagram name right here, Patty Cuts. Can you guys see it? I don't know, it might be too bright. But yeah, Patty Cuts. And then on the back, it has a life-size picture of the actual clipper and it has all the, you know, everything that is packed with all the new designs and everything so yeah that's how the box look i'm going to open it up but i'm not going to take everything out because they do the same thing with every babbage clipper they have you know like a brush a blade setter and they have the oil and everything so we don't need to take that out we're just going to take out the clipper so i can show you guys how it looks so usually when you buy babbage they don't have this extra sleeve on it they only do this for the influencer collection trimmers so now we're going to unbox it so i can show you guys the actual trimmer and inside they have you know the metal casing it says influencer collection on the top and um Babbage just started putting this on there the um it's like a verification that it's actually Babbage certified so you know it won't be fake or anything so that's dope let's open it up so i can show you guys what the trimmer looks like in hand and everything that it packs and i'm also going to tell you guys my pros and cons on it you know and my honest feeling about it you know so this is how they look in hand very similar to the original, you know, the gold babbles, the silver babbles, the rose gold. Um, they do have a new diamond-like coating blade on it. It's a deep tooth blade. It's kind of different than um, their original blades. They said that they did something different to make it cut better. I've watched a lot of videos and Patty said that he wanted a better blade that slides against the skin. And to be honest though, this blade hits, but I have a couple problems with it. But I'm gonna tell you guys that at the end of the video. Right now, we're gonna talk about some of the new things that they have. Like I said, they have a new rubber grip. It helps, you know, hold the clipper. It makes it feel more premium and it doesn't slip out your hand as easy. Um, it's just a comfortable feel and it's like snug in your hand. You know, you feel real safe with it. So guys, that's all the details that I have about the new Patty Cuts Edition Influencer Collection Tremor. Now I'm gonna tell you guys about the pros and cons and I'm also gonna show you guys a video of me using them so you guys can see how they cut. So first we're gonna start with the pros. Like I said, this trimmer isn't that much different than the original ones that we've been using. Other than the new rubber grip and the new blade, those are my two pros that I have for it. The rubber grip, you know, helps make it feel more premium and it actually helps have a better control when you line it up. You don't have to add those um, little like rubber bands on it. That's basically what they tried to eliminate. They wanted to make it, you know, where it's more comfortable and you have more control. And for the blade, it doesn't get hot. Um, I've recognized that it doesn't get as hot as the original blade. So I don't know if they purposely did that, but whatever material that they use, it definitely doesn't get as hot as the original blade does. So next we're gonna talk about the cons. I only have one con of this clipper and that's the new blade. I don't know if I messed them up, if I um, dropped them, I don't think I have. But I find myself when I cut fine curly hair, it snags, it doesn't just lay down and cut it kind of pulls a little bit but it might be my fault because on the gold babbles i've had problems with them cutting good and then one day they just start snagging or maybe i dropped it 
and it just went off track you know they're all dope dope trimmers but i've had like three different babbitt's trimmers to do that on me and i'm pretty sure you guys have too let me know in the comments but yeah so i maybe did this myself i'm not saying that this blade sucks or this isn't a bad blade because it's a new blade but i'm having a problem right now that's not saying don't go and buy this because i'm saying that it snags that might be my problem because i've had a lot of problems with my babbitt's trimmers and i think majority of them come from me dropping it i'm gonna figure it out though so right now i'm having to you know switch out when i'm cutting fine hair but as far as like thick hair this is dope i mean this is a dope trimmer but yeah you guys that's all i have for this trimmer like i said there wasn't really much of a difference between the original trimmers other than a new rubber grip and a new blade on it um i think it was a good upgrade though so i'm gonna figure out this blade you guys and i'm about to show you guys a video of me actually using the trimmer so i can show you guys how it hits but yeah, that's all for the video, you guys. I appreciate you for watching. Make sure you guys smash that subscribe button. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram, at JoshXBarber. Stay tuned for more videos. It's your boy Josh, and I'm out.